Olga Corbett. This is her specialty. Remember that. Now, Jim, watch this part coming up here. This is the... A backflip to a catch. She's made it again. Looks more like Monday night than last night. Little girl is an absolute sensation. Now, watch this. Drops to the low bar. Back up over the high bar. And she's having herself some kind of night. Now she's going to get set up for... No, here's the dismount now. A layout wow. back over the low bar. For age 17 and 83 and a half pounds, that is some courage and some poise. Remember the things that happened as we showed you on Monday night, victory, last night, defeat, and tonight, it may well be victory again. She needs 9.85 to take the lead. And she, she didn't get it. 9.80 ties her for the lead right now with Erica Zucco, so she could still get a gold medal. The crowd thinks it ought to be about 10. In all honesty, Jim, I have to agree with the judges. She's spectacular, but she's really not quite on. We'll see, we'll see why here in just a moment. There's the drop. Now she has to fight it just a trace there. Again, she is a little bit lower in her dismount, and it's really probably not going to get her a gold medal. And Olga's kind of having a nice time now. She didn't know whether it be to cry, laugh, or be embarrassed. And now she just put on her red socks and relax. She knows she has 11,000 friends anyway. We'll return in a minute to the games of the 20th Olympiad and the saga of Olga Corbett.